Hey everyone, Ryan from Foxtech here. And today, I'm going to walk you through how to clean up your iCloud storage on your iPhone. If you've run out of space or just want to manage what's taking up your iCloud storage, I've got you covered. Let's dive in. Now, if you're primarily looking to manage photos on iCloud, I'll be honest. I'm not a big fan of using the iPhone interface for that. Personally, I find it much easier to go to a computer, open a web browser, head to the iCloud website, sign in with your Apple ID, and manage your photos from there. It gives you a lot more control and is quicker in my experience. But don't worry, there are still plenty of things you can tweak and change directly from your iPhone. First, let's start by opening the Settings app on your iPhone. Tap your name at the top of the screen, then select iCloud. From here, tap Manage Account Storage or Manage Storage. This is where you'll see a breakdown of what's using up your iCloud storage, whether it's photos, messages, backups, or other apps. For example, if you have old iPhone backups taking up space, you can easily delete them. Tap Backups, select the device you want to remove the backup for, and choose Delete Backup. This will free up a significant amount of space if you're no longer using that device. Next, you can clear out your iCloud Drive. Tap on iCloud Drive in the Storage menu and review all the files saved there. If you have documents or files you no longer need, delete them to make more room. Another great way to optimize your iCloud storage is by managing your photos. Under iCloud in the settings, go to Photos and enable Optimize iPhone Storage. This option saves smaller versions of your photos on your iPhone while keeping the full resolution versions in iCloud. This can save a lot of space on your device while still keeping your photos backed up. You'll also want to go through the other apps that use iCloud like Messages or third-party apps. Review any old or unnecessary data these apps are storing in iCloud and delete what you no longer need. Lastly, don't forget to empty the recently deleted folder in Photos or other apps. Items in this folder still take up space until they're permanently deleted, so clearing it out is an easy way to free up even more storage. That's it for today's video. I hope this helps you manage and clean up your iCloud storage efficiently. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe for more tips. Thanks for watching, and see you later.